APNU AFC councillors stopped the Rose Acknowl Zealus NDC special meeting last Wednesday due to claims that it was illegal. More in this report. On Wednesday, March 17, 2021, the APNU AFC NDC councillor, Mr. Christopher Wordsworth, along with RDC councillor, who is also a part of the APNU AFC, Mr. Delon Crawford, stopped a special meeting that was held at the Rose Acknowl Zealist NDC under the claim that it was illegal for the PPPC councillors to hold such a meeting. Speaking with this newscast, Mr. Wordsworth explained why he says so. Here at the NDC we have a chairman and five other councillors for the PPP, a total of six of them who would have resigned and the, the resignation would have passed through a statutory meeting. Now we have a chairman who would have resigned, want to call a special meeting to rescind their resignation after they would have met with the general secretary of the PPP. This is total nonsense and it will not be accepted. And that is why we are here this morning to stop this meeting from continuing because it is deemed illegal and it is wrong. RDC councillor Mr. Crawford shared what was his input during the meeting. So we are here in, uh, to see if we can um, let the, council, the former councillors know that they're, what they are doing or what they are attempting to do is, is unconstitutional. I don't know if, um, and this is one of the reasons why we as councillors keep asking the government for them to produce the councillors with, 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 with documents, with, with the constitution, so that they can able to understand what the constitution says so that they could keep in line with it. And Further, he noted the following. We are saying right now that the meeting that has been held at 10 o'clock today, a special meeting, it's illegal, it's wrong, it's unconstitutional. The law does not provide for that. And if they resign, there's an uh, upcoming um, local government election this year. They could go again and, and, and try to represent their constituency. But as it is now, they resign and they resign already passed. So start their meeting, that means there are no more councillors. And, and so should not be summoned any summoned in any meeting. The overseer should have known that to send out a, a notice to the councillors to um, notify them of such meeting. And um, we need we need the constitution to be circulated so that the overseers of all the NDC of Guyana and all the councillors to be afraid with what the constitution says. Thank you. Narima Ali, Channel 8 News.